Auto save. What for? I was hoping you'd come. You did so much for my Fenriel already, but... Oh, we need to go... I visited talk... him among the oh, people, but he turned me away. I know the demons still play. We gotta him. go talk to the Dalish. And now they've taken him. Uh... Two days ago, Fenriel went into a nightmare and hasn't returned. What? Surely there are mages who can pursue him in the Fade. I have contacted Keeper Marathari. The Dalish have an ancient ritual that might help. But it requires someone Fainreal trusts to enter the Fade to free him. The, the, he doesn't trust the Keeper? He can't be woken up. The Keeper says he is near death. His lips still fog a mirror. But that is all. This is hardly my area of Yeah, I'm not a mage, but... But is there anything I can do? Marith Harry is coming to perform the ritual that will bring Fainreal back. His childhood thing. Oh, he's here! here. Anchor him. Frolic through dreams? Sounds like an experience. I'm gay. <laughs> You'll need someone experienced in the faith to come with you. I've already called for the keeper. We need to begin the ritual as quickly as possible. Would you like to stay here or return when she arrives? Um. I kind of wish I'd gone to go talk to them first, but we'll check this out. Let's do it. This is too urgent to delay. Indeed. You have been far kinder than I had any right to expect. If I can't save my sister, I'll at least save who I can. <gasps> she's... She's coming to the alienage! Does she only see sorrow? Oh! People know enough to give her deference. I've never seen a keeper outside their clan, and I've never seen city elves show deference like that, even to a human. This is intense! Like, wow! That was beautiful! It really was. Jeez. I came quickly, Ariane. I did not wish to tell you by letter how grave your son's situation is. The magic he possesses makes him what the oh. Devinter is called Somniari, a dreamer. Dreamers have the power to control the beyond, what humans call the Fade. Fainreel is the first in two ages to survive. What? Why are they so rare? Dreamers have great power in the Fade. They attract demons. Luckily, most prove too frail of mind to survive a demon's possession. A dreamer abomination would be near unstoppable. Wow! What can a dreamer do? I've never do? heard of this distinction. Dreamers are unique for their ability to enter the Fade at will. Is that what Solus is? Without the aid of Lyrium. In the Fade, they can shape dreams <gasps> and even affect the world beyond the Fade. Is this going to, to Dragon Age Inquisition? Some used to enter the minds of sleepers <gasps> and slay them in their dreams. That's Is horrible. there a difference between the Beyond and the Fade? They are the same. By either name, the Fade is the realm of spirits, Thedas's heart. While the mortal realm is its strong arm. The demons who live there covet the bodies of mortals. Her staff is and rad. Seek to possess them. Only mages ever touch the Fade in a waking state. Others see it in dreams. Indeed, indeed. What exactly are we going to do here? The elves of the Dales were experts in the Somniari arts. Oh! They could even help those with no power Ooh! enter the Fade. I have done my best to recreate the ritual. She may not know all the parts. We will use Fainreel's childhood home as a focus to draw him back through the Veil. Whoa! Oh, pfft. Just send me into the Fade. I told you her courage was legendary. <laughs> Now, Ariane, please excuse us. We must prepare. Oh, of course. Yeah, why does she have to leave? 
There is more, I must tell ah. you, that is not for her ears. You just want me to look. We'll take this a little bit seriously. Is Fainrail in danger? Indeed. And the danger may not come from what you think. Fainrail cannot become an abomination. The destruction he would cause is unimaginable. If you cannot save him from the demons, you must kill him yourself. <laughs> A death in the Fade will make him what your circle calls tranquil. He will be no threat after. Oh, boy. But... But... That's Fainrail's greatest fear. I won't be the one to She wouldn't country. let Bethany do it. I have no choice but to she leave wouldn't, it in uh, your She wouldn't let hands. Anders kill his friend instead no. of being a tranquil. Gather a team, and we will begin. Oh, boy. Choose oh boy. carefully, for all will face temptation. Oh, boy. I never give in. <laughs> I worry what a journey to the Fade might oh, be. Oh, I'm bringing you to 100%. Can I come? I'd love to see the rich <laughs> And I promise I, I won't be a bother. Of course, Let us begin. of course you can come. Ooh. <laughs> uh. They, uh, yeah, they, they won me over with their comments. I can't not bring those three. Well, except for Andrew. Andrew's is coming because I want to see. Hawk wants to see him in the fade. See what he looks like. See what he is. Isabella just wants to ah. I had not thought to it. Justice, I for. But it is good to feel the breath of the fade again, not the empty air of your world. We're just here for a visit. Oh dang it! So don't get too homesick. I am Justice. Anders has told you of me. Come, I send Spain wheels my. Wow! We will not have. Oh my gosh! <laughs> Uh, I thought Anders didn't want to come. Come, <laughs> let us act while we still <laughs> can. Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on a second, hold on a second. Does that happen to every mage in the Fade? I am Justice. Anders has told you of me. Come, I sense Fainwheel's mind straining. We will not have much time. Wow, doing the middle option for some reason gives Anders five rivalry and Meryl ten rivalry. I I have no idea why. Um, maybe the fact that I recognize Justice gave me points? I don't know, but we'll go back to the previous one. That was odd. Uh, yeah, but apparently this is the Templar Hall. I don't know what of. But no, I feel like... Hawk is going to want to try to protect mages when she can, even more so now than before, because she couldn't protect Bethany all the way, and she maybe will see it as some sort of penance. But, but I, I mean, I knew it was Justice too, but I didn't think he would be so active. Come, let us act while we still can. It's good to hear his voice again. But... Is it the justice I know? Or... Who is it? Who is it that I'm speaking to? The Templar Hall. Well, what's in... This is like a... That's like a main hall. I don't know what's in this side room, but... Well... Woo! It's rare to see two forgotten magics Anders? in one day. Or Meryl? It's usually a slow place, a fade. Not many surprises. I wasn't sure I'd like this one, but it has potential. Why are you speaking to the us? Demon of ah! It exists to make men forget their purpose and their pride. Anders was perfect to bring to this with justice. Justice Only can guide us through the fade. I have a proposition that might interest you. I don't work with demons? I will not give in to temptation, fiend. 
Have it your way. Okay. Oh, okay. Well, oh, because Meryl would want to maybe make friends or whatever with demons or something. But Bethany and Anders didn't like demons, so I'm not going to risk it. And I ain't going to... But because the, the lady, the, the keeper told me. The keeper told me that temptation was going to be here, you know what I mean? Everything here is cold. We're in the fade. I wish I'd worn shoes with soles now. It's like underwear that never sits quite right. What's these, um, ah. What was it that he wanted from me, though? I am curious. Oh! A door. Autosave. Thainrail's desires. Oh, boy! I'm just really intruding, aren't I? What is he? What? Why are we here? Has he been? Has Faneril been here before? Oh! Oh! <laughs> what? Things do not act as they should. Um. Door. Uh oh. Is this some sort of puzzle? Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. I don't think Fainrail's ever been to a Templar Hall. I don't know why this would be in his dreams. Fainrail's Pride. Let's try that one first. Yeah, I don't think I can go anywhere else. Ah! Eh? There's magical tomes in there. Is this how the hall in Kirkwall is set up? Why so many autosaves? Whoa! Am I going to? Okay. Wait, no, I'm not. I'm a ghost. I'm a ghost. I am! My Woo! people, I present to you our hope. His features may mark him as human, but in his heart beats the blood of the Dales. He came to us to learn his heritage, to release the power from a lineage as ancient as our race. I... I don't know what to say. Um... Okay. Are we recreating an event or what? I don't understand. This is a trick. First Enchanter? What are you doing the here? The First Enchanter's an elf? Your mother told me the Dalish are honorable. Why would the Keeper lie? Why would she entrust her people to a human? You are one of us, Fainreel. Your magic will restore our greatness. But, but you told me this magic was outlawed for a reason. Ah. Even the Dalish don't practice it anymore. That's a demon, Fainreel. It wants to trick you. He lies. The first enchanter is a pawn of the Templars. No. Silence, ah, demon. Okay. Weren't you? Keeper Marathari warned me of yes. this. Yes. You're not the Keeper. Mother's people have no circle, but they don't consort with demons. You. Why did you interfere? Because he deserves better. Whoa. 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 With my power joined to his, Fainreel would have changed the world. The boy only wants his freedom, not your power. Yeah. Those who are free to choose always want power. You think your friends are different. 
You think this elf, with her innocent face, would turn down a demon's offer? She didn't before. How about it? Would you take what I offered the boy? Scion of the Dalish, savior of elvenkind. Can you do that? Meryl! I am the greatest of my kind. Whatever tricks your little pet has taught you will pale in comparison. Uh, should we try to be, uh, uh, All right. When he puts it that way. I cannot put you ahead of the fate of my people. You took my dreamer. Now you'll take his place. Uh, I thought that said win, and I about had a cow. Wait, what? Oh my gosh! No! Okay, wait, 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 that was wrong! That was wrong! That was wrong! <laughs> I, I thought it was like joking! Greatest of my kind. Whatever tricks your little Let's hope this works. Pale in Demons always turn on you in the end. I what? cannot put you ahead of the fate of my people. You took my dreamer. Now you'll take his Meryl, what? What? Nope, we're trying the other one. Hold on, hold on a second. I'm just... If I have to do the rivalry, I will. But... So, does Meryl have a little demon pet? Is that what it's saying? Like, a, well, you know, a little demon that is, that he calls her pet or whatever. Of my kind, whatever tricks your little pet has taught you will pale in comparison. Do it and you're a dead woman. Whoa! I... You... Whoa! Whoa! Was this a really bad idea to bring Meryl? Hold on, I mean... No matter what you do, she fights you? Um... Well, I think my hop... I think that was supposed to be like a joking, like, oh, when you put it that way. But how is... Is this going to affect the rest of the game? I didn't realize. I mean, people have mentioned that there's an event later on down the line where you can purposefully really switch up Meryl's from friendship to rivalry thing. But, shoot, man. I thought that would be like a personal quest for her though, not this. Jeez. I... I suppose I we're gonna have to beat sense into Meryl. But, but you told me that you're, you're, you. Though you think how I am the greatest of my kind. All right. When he puts it that way, I. You took my trip. All right, Meryl. I'm glad I didn't redo your tactics for some of your new things. Don't make me do this! Ah. Okay, this guy is easy. Am I doing this wrong? Wait, hold on, hold on a second. Hold on a second. I changed it. Right? I changed it. Yeah, okay. Where's Meryl? Oh. I love it when a plan works out. We've lost. Meryl? What now? This is no time to speak. Am I gonna lose them all? Something, Something about, about this place is unsettling. It's like underwear. Never quite what the heck? Uh, I, uh, uh. The ceiling is gorgeous. Desire, are we gonna? Demons. They seek the truth. They seek his power. He's an enemy. 
I upped my um my strength, and that seems to be helping a lot. Okay. Off to Fangrill's desires then. Why was it just Isabella? Where did Anders go? Who am I now? My I'm mom. Oh no. That's it, Fangriel. Pardon the downstroke, then lift. Good. I'll have you scribing all my letters soon. If I'd known you were such a great lad. That's his dad. I'd have brought you into the business years ago. Does that mean I can come with you to Antietha, father? Mother said maybe this summer. Oh! Right, mother? That's not your father, Fainrael. It's a demon. And I'm definitely <laughs> not your mother. A demon? No. No, I want this. Then remember this. Is who took away them. Only thing you ever wanted. Ah! Huh? You. You turned him against me. Your voice is weird. Oops! <laughs> Complete accident. <laughs> I was trying to help, honest. <laughs> take away my pets, and I'll take away yours. Oh, Isabella's gonna I get dragged away so quick. You drag him to the fade. Would your pirate queen stay if the open water beckoned? What do you say, sweetheart? A two-mast brigantine, square made Oh of sin, no! A hundred well-built. So oh, Isabella! <laughs> I know you've been looking for a <laughs> master. Hmm. <laughs> oh, go! Come on, we can try. Um, don't fall for it. This is a demon, Isabella. Don't let it tempt you. Well, if it wasn't a demon, I wouldn't think it could grant wishes. The silence call too awaits in Kirkwall Harbor. I will be under the furs in the captain's quarters. Oh my gosh! I like big boats. I cannot. Oh move. my god! Isabella! Oh, what? I can't hit you for that! Oh, I'm gonna hit you so hard just because of that! Oh man! Oh man, Anders, come on, buddy! Don't leave me, Anders! Okay, uh, is that everyone? It is. We won. Anders! What are we going to do, Anders? Justice, Anders? Where's Anders? I'm not hitting it. Oh, let's see what the quest update's telling me. I'm gonna so <gasps> Um, was it? Uh. Oh, okay. That's it? <laughs> oh, go! I like big boats. Oh my gosh. Can't get through that door. Why are we even here? And where is Fainrail out here? Did Anders make it through? Maybe it's because Justice has been possessing him and Justice is more part of the Fade. Justice has been tr I thought Justice was trying to get back to the Fade, but now apparently he's semi-content with his thing with Anders. I can't spend another moment in this place. The screaming. Everywhere, all I hear are the nightmares of people dying, fleeing, gnawing their own arms off to escape. This is a world of monsters. And they all want me. Please. Help me escape. Help me die. You won't die. If I kill you here, I only destroy your mind. You will become a tranquil. I was afraid of that for so long. I can't even remember why. Don't. To live. Don't give in. To sleep without dreaming. To Fight. never hear a demon's whisper. It is a blessing as great as standing at the Maker's side. Do it. No. Put the knife in my heart. No. You can master this talent, Fainrail. You don't have to let it destroy you. The Dalish do not have what I need. Perhaps to Vinter. If these powers can be trained, it would be there. Uh-oh. 
I can do this. You can. You might not need to venture, but you can do it. I just let an incredibly powerful mage escape. Wow. I'm gonna beat up Isabella so hard. Fainrail has mastered his powers. Then he lives. Did he go to Tevinter? Is he gone? I cannot thank you enough. Keeper Marathari, may I return with you to the Sunderlands? I would like to ask for my son's forgiveness. Of course. It was you who chose to stay away. He must go elsewhere to train. There is no one in Kirkwall to help him. He asked me to say goodbye. My son? No. I must find him before he goes. It is wise for him to seek guidance. Kirkwall cannot provide what he needs. I truly did not think what you did was possible. You are a rare human indeed. You have my apologies. It is easy to forget that one cannot bind demons with words. Your friend awakened here some time ago. No one is immune to a demon's offer. You accomplished a miracle with Fainrail. This book belonged to the last dreamer of our tribe. Whoa! It has a rare magic beyond price. Please. No! Accept no, it. No, I don't want it! I'm not gonna take your history! No! <laughs> I hate it when people give me things that are absolutely priceless. And like a book, like what am I gonna do? Like if I could actually sit down and like read that thing, like a big tome, like that would be rad, but I can't. G G Isabella! <laughs> Could we stop by the Isabella! <laughs> I'm thirsty. I have tried to avoid the fade since justice. It's disturbing when he takes Oh, off. so you haven't gone to the fate at all. Okay. Interesting. Meryl? You lost. How is it you don't know what it is? It was in a box. It was in a box. And you didn't open it? You managed to resist the urge. Good question. It was locked. It was a locked box. And... Hasn't stopped yeah. you before. What do you want me to say? Nothing. I just found it curious, that's all. <laughs> Meryl! <laughs> Isabella, I can understand. She was just stupid. <laughs> it, yeah, time to speak to you, Meryl! Are you okay? I, I can't believe I turned on you. With the demon in the fade, I'm so sorry, Masaranas. I'll understand if you can't forgive me. Uh, eh. If I held a grudge against everyone who attacked <laughs> me in the dream, I'd have no friends. <laughs> How do you do that? Make everything better with a smile. It's like magic that doesn't get you in trouble. <laughs> well, it's my charm. I've been so careful in all my dealings with spirits until now. To make such an obvious mistake. It's been three years. It frightens me. It takes so little for a mage to fall. Hmm, interesting. What do you do to protect yourself from demons? The Keeper taught me. In the Fade, you must believe nothing but yourself. Everything there is a lie, or a trick, or a trap. I knew not to trust, and I don't know why I did. Huh. What made you give in? Her deepest desire. It felt like every word the demon spoke reached out and pulled at my heart. I didn't want to believe it, but I just had to. Be more careful. We're already in a lot more danger than most mages. Because of the blood magic. I know. I'll be more guarded from now on. Thank the creators you were there. It won't happen again. I'll make sure of that. We're g oh, we're good! Holy crap, have we like... Did we max? I don't think we did, but we might almost have maxed her out. Almost, jeez. Oh my gosh, and Anders too! Isabella, I'm gonna punch you. Don't think I won't. <laughs> <laughs> 
Do you guys say anything in anybody's house? I think I need a no, bath. No, you don't need a bath. Do you You're think fine. I need a bath? We should get moving. What is this mirror thing she's got in her house? That's new. That is so new. Let's just, let's go. Isabella! <laughs> Where are we? We're in Lowtown? Isabella! <laughs> I'm gonna come punch you. <laughs> With my words. I know I need to upgrade her, but I'm just not worried about it yet. So it looks like I have to talk to everybody that went into the Fade with me. I never have affairs with my crew. Once they see you naked with your ass in the I air, was curious, they actually. <laughs> Meryl! Oh, hey, it's Meryl! Men. Oh, you have to be twice as tough to earn half as much respect. So did the crew member mutiny? I mean, after you... You know... <laughs> <laughs> oh no. I had the offending member removed. <laughs> I got rid of the attitude. <laughs> I. Oh, look, it's Hawk. What are you. What stories are you telling, Meryl? <laughs> you okay? Why'd you I walk like away? Big <laughs> I cannot lie. Really, Isabella? <laughs> well, I do. Blighted Demon knew it too. I'm sorry I abandoned you in the Fade. I'm kind of surprised of Anders Justice didn't... I mean, I didn't even get the ship in the end. <laughs> you backstabber. Uh, I think that's the mean one, but... You know... I don't blame you. I understand what it's like to be under the influence of a demon. Do I? You... What? That's it. No angry rant. Are you trying to get me to jump into <laughs> bed with you? Because it's working. Oh boy, uh, we're friends. Uh. Friends forgive each other. Now you're making my insides feel special. <laughs> oh, go away. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> what? Get, let me. Um, hang on. Let me see if I could get. Oh wait, no. I'll get, get off. Um. If I could do, um, oh geez, if I wanted to go back before that, I thought I had a save. Oh no, it was an auto save. I need to freaking remember that th not to trust the auto saves. Um, we could do one of the dark towns. Okay, um. Oh, look. let's load in. I want to see if the other one is actually the like a mean one, like you know, I'm angry. I'm actually angry at you, you know. It probably is, but I just want to check it out. Boop boop. Oh, shoot shoot shoot. Uh, but, yeah. What was that? Call the bartender. So, oh, Corf the bartender. So, I noticed some notes it, on the table. It, 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 uh. I never <laughs> men. So did the crew member? I ah. I like. Well, <laughs> I like big. I'm sorry, I abandoned. So you admit it? Oh, you'll okay. betray a friend for a ship. Hey, not just any ship. I could see the hard line of the hull, run my hands along the elegant curve of her prow. Oh! <laughs> the demon was in my head. Nothing but the ship made sense. I wouldn't have left you. You betrayed me for an imaginary <laughs> boat. My feelings are hurt. <laughs> I already said I was sorry. What more do you want? Would you like me to clean your privy for a month? Eee! No. Shit. I really shouldn't have said that. <laughs> uh, nah. <laughs> we'll go back with the other one. What's a speech? It's fine. I like the other one better. That one was a little bit too aggressive. I think it should. they should have had a joking option in the beginning, not just if you chose the backstabber option, you know? 
so it's fine. I think Hawk Hawk knows <laughs> that it was probably a bad idea to bring Isabella into temptation. <sighs> At least we know what it is that'll take her away from us, you know? Just keep her away from the docks. Okay, but now it's time to talk to Anders. Let's talk to Anders. This is going to be exciting. This is going to be interesting because I want to know if he says anything about justice. And I want to know if just just <gasps> maybe justice will come out and talk. Is that that was way too excited. That was way. I this is just I mean, I, I I keep thinking of them as like the same person but with Anders as the mouth, but justice is still in there as his own self. Sort of. This is the only place in Kirkwall I feel safe. Anders, you bet you better talk to me, Anders. The Templars have become more Anders! Than their hunt for me. No, no. Oh, he doesn't have to apologize, does he? Cuz he didn't fall. Well, the Templars have become no. more. No. I won't be able to stay here long. No. Okay. Um. Well, let's bring Varric. And oh, should I bring Sebastian? Hey, Sebastian. Um. Uh, I want to bring Meryl out. This is so difficult. What do I want to do now, though? I guess, um, okay, let's, let's see what we, fine, fine, you know what? Shut up. We'll give her dexterity and cunning. And this is what, I gave her some more of these things, but I think I want to give her an upgrade. Oh no, I gave her... Yeah, I did give her that last time, but now now she has it again. Okay. Um, okay, what do we want to do? Oh, right. We could do that. Ooh, we go to the Coterie. We could speak to Emmerich. We could do that. We could do the Underground Railroad. Forbidden knowledge. Um, I'm kind of interested in that. I don't want to get involved too much in that, so I'll save before that. But we'll see. Um, remove. I wonder how Sebastian would feel about all that. I wonder what Anders and Sebastian would talk about. I'm curious. Um... Eric. Eric? Hmm... Yeah, we'll see. Oh, Sebastian. Shut up, Sebastian. <laughs> Who is over here? Who's this? Kunari don't never get sick. I can turn him. Alright, I think I'm actually going to have to call this one here, unfortunately. Looks like my recording's all messing up again, so I'll give it a night. But, um, this was uh, probably going to be split in half or something, I don't know. But regardless, thank you guys for joining me. You guys will be caught up soon, but I'll probably be further ahead, but I definitely want to get your guys' opinions on the end of Act 1. Well, I will have already gotten your opinions on the end of Act 1 and the beginning of Act 2, so so maybe I'll try to hold off for a couple of days, but this all doesn't matter because it's not in real time. Yay! But I think I I, I think I'm basically, I probably will actually be a rival with this guy if if I if he is so chantry, like, woohoo, you know, then, yeah. I don't know if it's going to be a good rivalry or a bad one, but I'm going to try to not, you know, pussyfoot around. That's an actual phrase. So, don't hate me, but it's the only phrase I could think of. <laughs> but, yeah, I'm going to try not to be too, like, oh, let's try to make, you know, make sure he's okay with everything, you know, but I don't, I don't like being mean to people either, so.
but but Hawk don't care. She doesn't know Sebastian. He's some exiled prince. He just needs her help right now. But anyway, um, sorry about talking into the end of the recording. I apologize for that. So anyway, thank you guys again. I will see you in the next one.